to show you how you can connect your domain to Cloudflare website or how you can create DNS records, how you can um, let Cloudflare to protect your domain just by uh, pointing your domain to uh, Cloudflare. Now what we need to do is to get our domain name and uh, I have a domain name which I already created and what you need to do is to come over here and you add that domain name. So after you signing up with Cloudflare, you come to add site. This is what you'll be given and then you select add site. Okay, Cloudflare will give you this page and you'll select the product or um, the package which suits your requirements. Okay, when you look at this, there's enhanced security, lossless image optimization, automatic mobile optimization, catch analytics. Okay, and there's this one which go for uh, CNAME setup compatibility and other things to do. As well, there's this enterprise whereby you have to contact them and you have to talk about that. Okay, then there's this one which is uh, automatically at zero dollars, protects from DOS attack uh, mitigation, global content delivery network that is for CDN, uh, support via email, and many other things to do. Now, what you need to do here is to continue with uh, with that which you've chosen okay now uh, for the purpose of this video i'm just going to go with this okay what you need to do next here is to is to first add a dns record and to add a DNS record, all you need to do is, um, for the first time, I'm going to press add, and then I add the IP address of the server I want to point this to. Okay. But I will also maybe need to add another DNS record. I shift that. Then I point the IP address I want, and I click save. If I need to add more or create subdomains, then I will need to say square 2 g maybe like that. Maybe I point the IP address and then I select that. Or if I want it proxified, then I'll select that. If it's not proxified, then I'll do that. Okay. Then I select save. I'll keep on adding many DNS records as I need. Okay. Then I'll click save. Now, after here, the next step is for you to change the DNS or the name, the name servers. And all you need to do is to go to your domain name provider and you select, you select who, nah, name, name server. So you feel free to check out on YouTube on how you can manage your domain name or the name servers onto your, of your domain names on that site. Okay. So I'm going to check my domain name here. And I'll select my name servers and I'll select custom and then I'll add them accordingly. Okay. Then I click save. It's that easy. And then I'll come back to this and I'll just select done check name servers. I'll go through this if I told it is required. Click save. Then I switch on this. I click save. But um, depending on the on your requirements, you can do this or not. Uh, depending on your requirements. By the time you would want to point this, you know what you wanna do with that. Okay. And then you click save. And then you say finish up with that. Okay. Now we need to set tell Cloudflare to check if our cloud our domain is ready okay now you can click uh, re uh, reroute so that uh, you're updated if Cloudflare is already protecting your site so you can see that Cloudflare is protecting our site in the uh, if you are under development mode we can do if you're under attack mode okay then you can do this okay you can do that okay now you can do other things as you can see here you can see the analytics of your page visitors who are visiting your pages and the traffic which is being driven through your servers and uh, DNS records you can as well uh, do with the SSL you can 
useful strict O and you can do that SS SSLTLS recommender okay you can do firewall okay you can do access okay you can do speed yeah but you can do some opt optimization settings okay but this is for the business and uh, some other where you can have to purchase some some settings okay you can have to purchase some premium offers there and you can have to add uh, add workers rules network traffic and many other things to do with that but main major focus here was to show you how you can do that and you kick off with the other settings if you need to